Good afternoon, this is Leung from Sofia, Bulgaria. I'll be staying in Sofia for the weekend and get some food uh, to go from my favorite place. In Bulgarian, we could call this manja as well, which is basically like uh, just cooked food, uh, relatively easy dishes, I would say. It's called manja. But uh, it can be a bit of a derogatory term as well, because if you call a chef's food manja, it would be a little bit offensive. Uh, I don't know exactly how to describe it. It's not exactly the word for sludge either, but it's just uh, the sort of uh, quick food, I would say, um, which doesn't make it less tasty or less nutritious. What do I have today? I have Banira Nabiala Riba, this is Katofi uh, right here. So it is white fish with potatoes, costing 7 11, 11 cents, which is 3.5 euros. I have a pushko suris, which is a turkey meat with rice. Uh, then I have, actually, actually what it costs is uh, 6.11 30 cents, which is three euros. Then I have, just checking the receipt, this is uh, Bob. Wait, did she actually? Not sure I, I paid for the Bob. Ah, oh, yeah, here it is. Bob's is Kuftata right there. 621, which is again 3 euros, which is beans with meatballs and tomato sauce. And then I have three times Mlakosoris right here. Mlakosoris, um, written on the receipt right there. Mlakosoris is basically milk rice, or in German they would say rice milk. Uh, rice milk with uh, cinnamon on top, which is a common dessert in Bulgaria. It's mostly popular for kids. Uh, people make it at home a lot. Let's say your grandma makes Mlakosoris. People grow up with it, but then pretty much stop eating it unless it's a homemade thing. But uh, So you don't see it a lot in stores, but my favorite place has it. So what does Mlakosoris cost? It costs um, 261, which is one euro and 30 cents. By the way, I get 10% discount from this place. See, it says my name, Leon, and I get a, they give me 10% every time because I'm a Redoman client, like they say in Bulgaria. I'm a frequent customer, frequent client, and I got a loyalty card and I get 10%. So what do I pay for? Basically a day and a half of food because I already had some dishes from, uh, from yesterday that I have for today. So this is for the weekend. I pay 14 euros and basically it feeds you for a whole weekend. And you don't need to cook anything, basically I just heat it up, uh, I cook it in a pan, I don't have a microwave or something, or in the oven, and then you have a meal for yourself, and it's a lot cheaper than cooking individual dishes. Alright, just a quick video from Bulgaria.